Sam Suleiman versus Joel Camilleri. They recently fought over in Australia. Father Time has finally caught up with Mr. Sam Suleiman. Fight ended in the first round by TKO with Joel Camilleri winning this fight. Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So, um, yeah, if you want to watch the fights here on YouTube, that's where I watch it. Uh, but, yeah, it, it you know, it's starting off good for Sam Suleiman. Um, you know, like the footwork, look fresh on his feet. Uh, but uh, eventually, uh, Joel Camilleri was able to land a big right hand, looping right, that landed clean, rocked. Sam Suleiman, Camilleri went for the kill, was able to drop him. And uh, yeah, they didn't really show exactly how uh, Sam Suleiman looked while getting up. He probably got up, but then he was probably still in wobbly legs and uh, the referee stopped the fight. But yeah, um, yeah, father time was finally caught up to him. Uh, so the son has beaten the father. Uh, Sam Suleiman, if you guys don't know, going to this fight, he, he was 49 years old. 49 years old, Sam Suleiman. Um, there, there comes a time and point in your career where you should realize that it's it's probably best to hang up the gloves. And I hope Sam Suleiman realized that with this, with this loss. He had good wins, you know, at his age. He fought back in July against Troy O'Malley. Uh... But for whatever reason, he decided to keep fighting. He could have just retired with a win. Um, not just with Troy O'Malley, but also with Jesse White in the first fight and the rematch. He could have just retired after those wins. But um, Sam Silman has decided to keep fighting. Um, but yeah, it's definitely time to retire for Sam Suleiman. As for Joel Camilleri, good win for him. Um, knockout win. Three wins in a row now since losing to Cohen Mazuduer. And, um, yeah, I won't be surprised if we see Camilleri in there against a, a rising prospect uh, in, in, you know, in the domestic level over in Australia. Um, and if he keeps winning, who knows, he might get in there in a big fight against a, a rising name. Um, he's currently ranked number 62 by BoxRec and number 3 in Australia. Who's number 1 and 2? Zarafa and Isaac Hardman. Maybe he can fight one of those guys. Did he fight Zirafa yet? I'm not sure. Dwight Ricci. Maybe he could fight Zirafa. I think that would be a decent fight. Why not? Let's see him fight Zirafa. So, anyway. If you saw the fight, let me know what did you think about it in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.